In this video, we will learn very interesting charts which re reflect the budget versus actual in this form where we have some variance analysis in some green and red circles. So how I can get that green and red? I, it is through the window key and get the emojis which when I press window and that key we can get the emoji. Just pressing the window and select semicolon again I can get the emojis and we can select this emojis and, and when we go ahead in the video we will learn that so let's start how to prepare this so I'm going to one blank sheet so I have this some figure of the actual achieve and the budget data so out of that I just have to prepare a chart so simple chart is just select the data and go to the insert and here in the insert I just click this 2d chart so my just 2d chart is ready for that budget i want this to be overlap so i will go select that series and then go to the for if it is not visible i can also press control one so that series is visible i want it on the secondary axis and i want the graph width to be 100 percent so that it will be look uh, separate and fill size solid fill transparency I want it to be 50% and also I will change the border to solid line and increase the width of the border so that it will look different so now it will look nice now so now I am able to identify my budget and my actual is there now I want the variance whenever the actual is more it will get the some variance analysis so for that I have added one new column here for the calculation of variance the formula is actual minus budget divided by budget if I press I get the variance just copy paste it now variance is this but I want in my ledger that if variance is positive it has a green circle and it is negative give me the red highlight so for that I will use the if else function so I have my first logical test is when this value is greater than and equal to zero then give me this variance plus the emoji signs for getting that emoji I just told you we can go to that inverted commas this emoji is the text format so I have to press window and semicolon the screen visible you go to this emoji and then you have to go to the heart circle and then you have to just drop down and here you will get that red sign uh, green sign because here the positive is now I want to combine it with variance so I want the variance uh, for the negative even I want absolute value so th for that getting removing the negative the formula is ABS so it will give me the absolute value without any negative sign now my first condition is it greater than zero if it is less than zero so I mean logical test second is true if it is first is not true then it will consider the second and then result will be I want red emoji I will go to window semicolon and here same way just giving me the earlier emoji I have selected for but I am going so that you will know red emoji bracket close and ABS I want select this number bracket close so I get my label here but still it's not in the format percentage so I want also the percentage for getting the percentage sign I have to when I select this cell I have to change it in the I will use the text format to change it into the percentage so I will select this comma 0, 0.00 percentage I will get the percentage sign bracket close for text formula same here I will do that text comma 0 0.00 and percentage sign bracket close now see I am able to get the percentage formula I just copy paste shit formula 
so now your work is done but here you are not able to see the green and uh, red sign but if i select into the chart i just select the actual and here i will go to the data label in the data label i will go to the more option in the more option i don't want this value i want value from the cell so i will select this range just click ok see i am able to get the variance analyzer just press ctrl b to get it a bold now i also want the actual to be display how much the actual are and how much the percent variance so for that if i select actual and get into the data label more option if i ask him to get the value but here its value is giving after a separation i don't want like this so instead of i will select the budget series and go to that data label more option instead of getting the budget figure i will ask to get the value from the cell i asked him to get the actual click ok and make it inside at or inside base inside bit so i will get the actual figure here so i will able to know how much actual is there so i can remove the chart title because here i don't want the chart title because actual and budget also here i will also remove the grid line i just press uh, go to that this line and grid lines click okay and also i will check the axis here you must ensure that your axis minimum maximum are same if it's not you can change it from here right now it's same though i will remove this one axis so now my chart is ready which is depicting me the actual where it is more in the green sense or i will it will highlight it to me and it's a good visualization thanks for watching this video hope you like this actual versus budget chart